Hey there everybody, Andrew Roboto here, and welcome to Five Nights with SMG4, where this is a, a, a Nintendo FNAF fan game made by the creator a, a, ABS Coder 2007, and the original FNAF by Scott Kaffner. And anyways, um, as you can tell, this game is based off a Nintendo game because it's got Mario, Luigi, and then there's two evil versions of Mario and then and Luigi I believe and then there's a girl in the middle who looks like Rosalina. But anyways, um, without further ado, we'll start a new game and see what it's on for us. Oh, we get a cutscene from Maggie. My name is Maggie. I was in a good place. I wanted it to be a better place. Not like this. I am teamed with Mr. Monitor to fix this. SMG4 Mario, Luigi, Terry, or Tari, sorry. I will try my best to save you. Save you all. Are you ready? I mean, it says, are you really that dumb? What? Who was this? Who was that? <laughs> it's a me. Oh God. Okay, so it's Mario's jump scare. Nice intro, Mario. Okay. We get a phone call. We have doors to close. Oh, I can hawk the nose. Nice. Oh, the door and window have Mario on it. Nice. Oh, we can charge the power? Oh, we can recharge the power. Nice. Oh, we can recharge the power. Nice. Phone guy is the same as Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Okay, this camera one is from Mario 64. That's just a show stage. Camera 6 is from Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Same with camera 4. And then camera 5 from Final Fantasy 2, and then the rest of the cameras are just regular. The regular cameras are just. The other cameras are just regular cameras. All hail the meme guy. Nice. Okay, ignore that pop up that just showed up on my computer. I don't know what that was. Except there is no maintenance panel in this game. Okay, so night one is a freebie, just like Five Nights at Freddy's 1, where, I mean, what I meant to say was fi this, night one in this game is a freebie, just like Five Nights at Freddy's 3, where we're not dealing with any animatronics, we're just taking the time to get used to the place. And that phone call is from Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Like I said, the cameras look pretty interesting. There's three cameras from Five Nights at Freddy's, one camera 
Cam 1 is from Mario 64. Cam 4 and 6 from Final Fantasy Freddy's 3. Cam 5 is from Final Fantasy Freddy's 2. And then we have the door and window to close, and we have, and we can recharge the power and the comp control. So that's pretty cool. Oh, and we've beaten I-1 with no coincidences. And I'm just enjoying chocolate milk right now while I'm listening to the intro. That's a really nice explosion. Really nice music for 6 a.m. Okay, so what do we have next? Oh, it just jumps into night two. Which we will take on night two as well in this video since I have enough time to do it. Oh wait, there's no audio cues in this game. It's just door, a door, a window, and a camera, and a recharge button. That. Oh, it's another phone call from Final Fantasy uh, Story. And I just had to deal with a Mario hallucination on the camera and in the office, too. Ah, hallucination. So switch the camera. Ah! Nope, you're not killing me. I know your hallucination. Ah! Okay, I just got rid of two hallucinations who who look a lot like Mario or Luigi. I don't know. Who. They're they're basically the evil versions of them. And I don't know who we're going to deal with at the door and window, because I'm checking and I don't see anyone there. So far, I've only had to deal with a hallucination in my office and on the camera. And if the hallucination comes into the office, we have to put the camera up. And if there's a hallucination on the camera, we have to switch the cameras. And it works the same as Finance of Freddy's 3. The, f the first hallucination that's dressed in blue... That's on the camera works the same as Balloon Boy and Phantom Balloon Boy and Phantom Chica. And the hallucination that's in the office wall works the same as Phantom Balloon Boy. And then the others and then the other characters I can imagine are gonna work the same as Phantom Freddy, Phantom Foxy, and then who else? Phantom Mangle and then Springtrap. Oh, and it's already 5 a.m. I'm just checking. We just made it to... And we just beat night two again in this video. And since I got enough time left in this video, I'll take on night three as well. Okay, I wonder who we're going to be dealing with at the door and window. Or if we're dealing with anyone for night three. Guess it's time to find out. And we get a phone call, obviously.
Ah! Get away! Oh, and the camera just went down. Completely sparked in the manner where he can move it. I don't know what to do because the camera just went dark for a minute. Oh. Oh, I just I just switched to another camera if it goes black. Okay. That's good. Ah, get away from me. Hallucination. Ah, it's Luigi. Okay, so we're dealing with Luigi this night, and I'm assuming he's going to be coming for me the door or window. And we got to close it for us there. What's cool about the door and window is that Mario's on both of them. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, let me check for Luigi. I saw hallucination on my camera. There's Luigi. Luigi's moving. And I haven't had a deal with Mario or Tari yet. Which Tari's the girl that resemble, resembles Rosalina. And I haven't had a deal for yet. I haven't seen anyone at the door or window yet so far. Okay, I see Luigi. He's probably coming close or something. Ah, okay. Putting the camera up, I see a hallucination. Nope, you're not coming in. You're not gonna kill me, sorry. Let me check the door and window see if anyone's there. Nobody's there yet. I've only got to deal with characters coming into my office. Ah! Put the camera up. There's a hallucination. Checking the door and window. Okay, we have beaten night three in this video, so this, so these nights are going by pretty fast, if you ask me. And since I got enough time left in the video, we will take on night four in this video as well, and then I will end the video. Alright, on to night four, let's see what has to offer for us. Oh, this is from Finance of Freddy's 1, this phone call. And the phone guy's gonna get killed, I know, and I know that because I've played the first game before. Oh, Mario's in the computer. Oh my god, I just got jump scared by a hallucination. Oh, and it just... Oh, that's a really good game over music. And it just shows the whole game. Okay, let's try that four again, because I just got jump scared. Because I couldn't close the window in time. And I didn't even get to. And I'm gonna play the. I'm gonna play out the phone call because I didn't get to hear it.
And the phone guy is going to get killed. And I didn't get to hear the rest of the phone call, so I'm going to play it out. Because I got killed, so I didn't get to hear it. Oh, the phone guy's gonna get killed. Okay, the phone guy got killed. Okay, then. <laughs> that was pretty interesting. <laughs> and Mario's in the computer, and I can assume if he comes out, we have to put up a camera like we do in Final Fantasy Warriors 1. Because Mario's gonna work the same as in Final Fantasy Warriors 1, where he comes out of the computer and we have to pull it up in order to avoid a jump scare. And there's a blue character that comes from the window that I just got jump scared by. So I'm constantly checking, so... Alright, so night four is going to be the night where I start having to close the window. Maybe the door, I don't know. Okay, I just avoided a jump scare because he's a hallucination. Okay, I haven't closed the door yet, but... I know for a fact I'm going to have to close the window before I get jump scared. And the jump scares are the same as in Final Fantasy Freddy's 1. And Mario's moving closer, so I think one, so I think he's about to come out of the computer and i got to put the camera up to avoid a jump scare. Luigi, I just saw Luigi. Okay, how do I get rid? Okay. Did he leave? Okay, good. The blue guy left. Good. For a while, he was sitting in my office, and I had to get rid of him with the camera. And he and he has the same mechanic as Mario, where I got to put the camera up. Let me fix the camera because it glitched out. Okay, Mario's coming closer, so I know for a fact I'm going to have to put that camera up. I got it! Oh, God, Mario just startled me. Oh, so if Mario talks when we have the camera up, it means he leaves. Okay. Okay, so I put the camera up right when Mario was talking, so... Oh, and we beat Night 4. Perfect. And like I said, I put the camera up when Mario was talking, and that avoided, prevented a jump scare. Okay, so we will take on Night 5 in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, also comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.